Nikor Nikon 55 1.2 on a Nikon D7100 shot in aperture 1.2 video test not so sure about the sharpness yet my first impression was expecting a bit more from a 1.2 aperture and this is one of the old lenses factory converted AI uh, videos reading ISO 280 320 here I'm about to roll up outside the bokeh is nice <laughs> bokeh 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 everywhere all right We'll get to check out some focus and noise too. And that looks pretty damn crisp. Let me get something nice and ugly to focus on here. Do, 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 do. All right. All right. Looks. Buttery, buttery smooth. That is tack sharp. Downside about using these old Nikon lenses is the glass, everyone says, most people say, is superior. But they are manual focus, so we'll get to see if you can hear this focusing ring. So, look at this at 1080p. Wow, you can just watch that razor edge dance right in there. All right, I'm gonna move to the second one behind it and change our depth of field. Slowly, very slowly. And proceed on to the one in the bottom left hand corner. Okay. That is nice. I, I really like how the background looks pre-photoshopped. And, uh just blurred out to hell and back. That is awesome Boca. The bulky Boca. And I'm just gonna use this for a linear field aperture test. I just made that term up, so maybe I'll feel smart one day. <laughs> so I just went to the back. Let's go to the ladder. There's our, our field. Now we go linear. We're coming back in. Now. Alright. Well, this is pretty cool. I don't like lens and camera reviews where it's like, I'm going to review this all in one one little location and not change any parameters it's like dude come on haven't you ever heard of the scientific fucking method do it right and this is from across the way it's got a really good amount of zoom on our APS-C crop sensor so we got inside outside and here's my work area And a nice tungsten light is a good subject. So we got some natural light. We got this artificial bulb going on here. And I'll let you guys know how it goes for photos, but for video. Uh, I don't do a lot of it, but this is doing for my eyes what professional video does and what y'all do with those Canon D Mark III shooting in 1080p using old Nikon glass. You cheeky Canon people get to use our glass. But uh, I got this from eBay for a pretty damn good price. And my initial impressions are pretty... 
pretty damn impressed now. And uh, it's going to be awesome shooting manual portraits with this thing. <laughs> that was not me being sarcastic. The end.